Generally, my lab focuses on trying to make drugs work better. So most people think about the active ingredient in a drug, but there's also all of these inactive ingredients, quote, inactive ingredients. But they're really the thing that is the difference between a drug working and a drug not working. Hi, my name is Eric Apple, and I'm a professor of material science and engineering at Stanford University, and this is why my research matters. We work on what's called drug delivery, and delivery is focus both on getting a drug to the right cell or the right tissue. How do we get drugs to be faster? They need to be faster or deliver them over longer periods of time if that would improve their safety and efficacy. A lot of people are familiar with drugs like Ozempic or Wegovy. These are specific drugs for type two diabetes or weight loss. And right now they need to be delivered once a week, which is still really burdensome. And we've developed a technology that can encapsulate those drugs and it can be injected in the exact same way but slowly deliver the drug over extended periods of time. So you could turn 52 shots a year into only three or four. So one technology that's really core to a lot of our work are injectable hydrogels. These are what we use for the sustained delivery of drugs. We actually found out that we could take some of the same technologies and apply them to encapsulating fire retardants to prevent wildfires. That's the kind of thing that within a company, if you're doing pharmaceuticals, you can only make pharmaceuticals, but here in the academic setting, we have a chance to run with these crazy ideas and really bring them to fruition. 